It's the holiday season and time again to watch our favorite non-denominational snowflake time celebration films. But we're all sick of It's a Wonderful Life, A Christmas Story, and that claymation Conan O'Brien elf who wants to be a dentist. So here's the Nerd Alert Top 6 Alternative Holiday Movies That Mostly Don't Suck. The Nightmare Before Christmas. Is it a Christmas movie or a Halloween movie? Yes. Based on a living skeleton's existential crisis, this one looks at what it is to have and celebrate and embody a holiday at all. It also teaches that it's okay to branch out even if you fail miserably, and that warm and glowy feelings are for literally everyone. Well, unless you're a sentient big burlap bag filled with bug colonies and snakes, do not try to eat sandy claws. Coming in at number five is Rare Exports, A Christmas Tale. This little known film from Finland puts a great spin on the Santa Claus legend taking the character back to his pagan roots. Unlike holiday slasher flicks like Silent Night, Deadly Night, this movie takes a very restrained approach to horror, relying more on tension and mystery than big scares. Factor in the comedy and absurdity of a horror movie about Santa, and you've got the makings of a holiday cult classic. If you haven't seen it, do yourself a favor and check it out. Number four on our list is another scary twist on Christmas, Gremlins. Joe Dante's 1984 horror comedy tells the story of cute, cuddly creatures who transform into grotesque monsters and terrorize the town. This movie might not represent the traditional Christmas spirit, but it's chock full of holiday references and gags. If you're looking for a totally fucked up holiday movie to laugh and scream at, this is the one for you. You may notice there are no other December holidays on this list besides Christmas. That's because when I looked for those movies, I literally only found eight crazy nights. But there are films based around fake holidays. Surely you've heard of the celebration of the planet, loved ones who have passed, and young ones who provide hope to us all. It's called Life Day by the inhabitants of Kashyyyk from the notorious Star Wars holiday special. I need you to know that this is not a good movie. It is the first appearance of Boba Fett, but it is also poorly written, critically panned, and the main cast clearly doesn't want to be there, especially Harrison Ford. It also features a schmaltzy song to the tune of John Williams' Star Wars theme, sung by Princess Leia. Again, this movie is terrible, but I love it. Did you know that mistletoe can be deadly if you eat it? And a kiss can be deadlier if you mean it? Yes, Batman Returns is a Christmas movie featuring Merry Christmas in the very first and very last lines. There's a surprising amount of critical commentary toward over-commercialization of the holiday, as well as media portrayal and everyone falling for the penguins, I just want to find my parents, holiday ploy. Plus, there are a few better backdrops for the dark night than a cold, snowy Gotham night while everyone else is with their loved ones. Topping off our list of alternative holiday movies is, of course, 1988's Die Hard. John McTiernan's tale of a cop taking down 12 terrorists in a skyscraper on Christmas Eve is an action comedy masterpiece. Bruce Willis is great as the foul-mouthed cop John McClane, and Alan Rickman's screen debut as German terrorist Hans Gruber is brilliant. The holiday references throughout are subtle touches, but they add up to make this flick a Christmas classic. Now I have a machine gun. Ho, ho, ho. Those are our choices, but have I made a grievous error in not including your top alt holiday movie pick? I would have also liked to include Edward Scissorhands, but we already had two Tim Burton movies starring a dark weirdo scored by Danny Elfman, as well as Grumpy Cat's worst Christmas ever, but we already had one ridiculous travesty of a film that I like for no apparent reason. What else belongs here and in our living rooms and our hearts? Let me know in the comments, and a happy weasel stomping day to all!